Hey, everybody. So this is going to be a collective read. It may or may not resonate with you. All right, we got a jumper already. Like, that shit just flew over. We got filter. Filter, honey. All right, give me a message for um, the collective. <laughs> Fear of missing out. Okay, so somebody here. Filter, trying to make yourself look better. Things are not as they appear. Sugar-coated truth. Okay, so some something here isn't what it seems. And someone here is having a fear of missing out. Ooh, okay. Somebody shocked something. Somebody. Possibly with... Possibly... Hmm... Either with the truth, a sugar-coated truth, or somebody posted something, a picture. Possibly like with a filter on it. And it looks it looked good. So somebody is having a fear of missing out. Like I'm getting like somebody's like, oh my God. Oh my God. Shook, right? And then we got well played that jumped out too. They're like, ooh, did that? did that <laughs> did that but somebody has a fear of missing out netflix and chill a romantic chill date a sexual chemistry bait and switch sexual activity dating somebody could be trying to bait somebody look at this thirsty here somebody could be trying to bait somebody in with a video or picture oh and people are talking about it spilling the tea something juicy hidden Disclosing information, slander, gossip, shocking. Yeah, there's something that happened that was shocking. Something that somebody saw. It's really shocking. Mm. Low key. Somebody want to put somebody on blast. About some text messages. Somebody's texting their bae. Pictures. And videos. And they was turned up. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Low key and put on blast. Somebody wants to put somebody on blast. To not announce. To treat with little emphasis. Secretly not showing. Somebody wants to put somebody on blast. About somebody texting somebody's man. Or female. Somebody's day. Struggle is real. Hitting a rough patch in life. Frustrating situation. Somebody's frustrated. They're frustrated because their relationship is going through some struggles right now. Okay. So what I'm getting is what this sounds like to me. What this sounds like to me is that somebody is dealing with someone's ex. Maybe you're the ex. I'm feeling like this is this new, the new person's energy. Or side piece energy or karmic energy. Somebody could be dealing with your ex. Maybe you're out here looking good. And maybe they're maybe 
they talk about you, talk about your pictures or what you got going on, possibly on the internet. There's a lot of gossiping about it. They're mad and upset because their relationship is struggling. It's struggling. Relationship struggles are ended. Missing someone, emotional, lonely, depressed, sad. They might be telling your person, that, look, they, they ratchet. Now that's just ratchet. Person or place being wretched. <laughs> Behaving stupidly or reckless. Nasty, unappealing. Tell me more. And then we got yes. <laughs> but somebody's getting a bunch of likes. You might have got a bunch of likes. You have the green light. Go for it. Extreme satisfaction. Approval. Yes. Liking. Ooh. Somebody's bae. Like the picture. Mmm. But somebody wants to put somebody on blast. Somebody wants to put somebody on blast, okay, about some messages that they see in their bay phone or something like that, okay? For sure. For sure, for sure. Mm. They hating on y'all. <laughs> Yeah, see, you might have got a lot of uh, likes from males, getting a lot of comments, okay? They thirsty. <laughs> they want you, okay? Somebody, somebody, this, somebody feels like, oh, you trying to clap back? Bitch. They throwing shade. They over there throwing shade. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Humble brag. Don't be too obvious. Read between the lines. Self-promoting and disguised brag. So maybe you over here, you know, you ain't doing too, like, you don't feel like it's too much. You like, look, I can't help it if I look this good. I just did this kind of read for Scorpio. Some of y'all may be Scorpios. But it's like, hey, I can't help it. It is what it is. If I look this good, I look this good. Okay? Because you could be trying to find someone else okay you're moving on from this situation you're out here looking for a match you know you you're dating you're ready to mingle you're single and you're ready to mingle because you just got out of this you got out of a situation you bounced from a situation you left a person um it's time to wrap it up it is what it is okay now you you don't turn your savage on it's savage mode now why they over here looking like this looking like a simp <laughs> You over here done turned turn up your savage, okay? And you looking damn good doing it. This the clap back, honey. Didn't I tell you? Didn't I tell you? This was the clap back. And you <laughs> had a glow up, honey. You done had a glow up. You looking good as hell, okay? Now, this other person, this new person that they dealing with. Karmic for a third party. They over here jealous. Because, honey, you done got fine, fine. You done glowed up after the breakup. <laughs> Sipping tea. Careful who you listen to. Listen to constructive criticism. Listening to gossip news. And they a lot of people talking about it. I'm like, you done see? You see how such and such look? Child, they look good. You see? Mm, mm. They see it. Okay? You done, <laughs> you done clap back. Making a comeback. Look, I ain't no damn doormat. I'm going to fight back. And there was definitely a comeback for sure, for sure. And they over there sneak this. Mm. Salty, didn't I tell you, honey? They over there salty. Mm-hmm. Salty as hell. Sudden change of mood. Like, all of a sudden, they might have been posting, doing all this, doing all that. All of a sudden, it's quiet. Mm-hmm. Because you done turned that savage up. Sudden change of mood. Feeling someone did you wrong. Upset, bitter, annoyed, jealous. Didn't I tell you they jealous of you? 
they jealous because they can't do it. Uh -huh. And listen, honey, you done turned up since 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 you walked away, or since this person walked away from you. You got you getting messages, okay? Messages coming in for you. You a hot commodity. Now they want to try to put you on blast. Some of um. Oh yeah, I heard that she talked to. Oh, did you see that? Da, 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 da? They worry about if they if they they looky. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And then I'm pretty sure they are. But this person is jealous. Okay. They jealous as hell because you out here looking good. Okay. You really needs people in. You really needs males in or really needs females in. And you ain't gotta do nothing but post a damn pic and that's it. And here they come. Here they come. Here they come. Me and validation. Fishing for compliments. Here they come. I'm telling you, you getting you getting likes and hearts and recognition. And this person over here is salty, jealous. She had to put on a filter, so what bitch I still look good. With or without one. You just mad. <laughs> and they big mad. They big mad. I want to see if I can find out who this is. Let's pull out the Kipper. Who is this person hating on my collective? Okay, there's a connection. There is like a relationship or a connection, okay? Somebody has concerns about money in this relationship. In their connection, I feel like there's a concern about money, okay? Maybe you're at a distance from this person that you were dealing with. This could have been an ex, but somebody is a false person here. They're with a karmic. They're dealing with a karmic. A mature woman okay all right so somebody's mother or something like that this could be somebody's mother somebody's aunt or an older person like mm. okay because this is you the main female you the one who they who they the person really give a damn about but they over this mature woman is messaging them okay messaging them i'm like hey you see the change you see the change? They done bossed up. We got sudden unexpected income. They done bossed up. Maybe y'all didn't, you know, have a lot going on, but y'all done bossed up, okay? Mm -hmm. They was expecting for you to be sad over this man, okay? Over this man. But, but baby, what they didn't know was that <laughs> the comeback was sweet. Y'all might have came up came up y'all done bossed up okay y'all done bossed up on somebody and whoever this is she was expecting for you to be all sad and crying over this man and this connection because they in a relationship with somebody else over here they over here courting and having sex and doing something with somebody else honey guess what baby huh. let me show you something right quick let me show you something right quick mm -hmm. yeah you could be at a distance from this person. Okay, we got distant horizons. But this mature, this man, okay, this man over here, he the one over here like that. Mm-hmm. Because he expected for you to uh, miss him, go down without him or her, whatever the case may be. But, baby, <laughs> the main female done made some changes, okay? Done made some changes, Okay. You done got a you done got blessed in some way, shape, or form. Okay? You done got blessed in some way, shape, or form, honey. And something is working. Maybe some of y'all got a new job. I'm telling you, I'm getting a bossed up energy. Okay? Not his family. His family or her family. They sitting over there in the chat in the in the chat room and that sitting together in the group chat. They talking about it. Judging you. Judging you. Because guess what? It could have been a marriage involved, okay? But somebody over here 
and trying to steal your person or they did take your person but guess what that ain't nothing but some light work thank you i needed that person up off my hands type of energy mm -hmm. yeah they thought something was gonna work they thought something these people somebody had a plan they plot somebody plotted against you honey they put a false person in the mix they put a false person in the mix of this this union between you and your person and your person fell for this other person this mature woman had something to do with it this older person she had something to do with it but it's like ever since you and this person been disconnected you've been coming up they want to know how 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 they ain't have it before how they got it now they may want this person, they may want your person to have a child with this other person. They're trying to bring you down. But baby, let me tell you something. <laughs> let me tell you something. Y'all done bossed up. You hear me? Y'all done bossed up, okay? And they don't want to see it. These people don't want to see it. They over there softy. And I just feel like it's not just one person. I feel like it's a group of people. There's a lot of gossiping, a lot of chit chit chatter, a lot of you see, did you see, did you? Yeah. Cause I know you see it, honey. They see it. Tell me more for the collective. Give me another message. Six of Pentacles. So like this person that you, you're, this person that you were dealing with, I feel like they gave you the runaround. Got the Knight of Wands there at the bottom of the deck. I feel like they gave you the runaround, okay? This person could have been Emperor Energy. Could have been Aries. This person could have been older than you. Um, yeah, th I'm telling you, this person thought that you was going to be mad. They thought you was going to compete. They thought you, they wanted you to compete, okay, for this man. King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But you did Okay? Now, this is how they over here sitting over here looking sick. Yeah, two of cups. Look, this person could have a bunch of other options, okay? They got a bunch of other options. They may have chose somebody over you. We got the Ace of Pentacles and the Strength could be a Leo. That person could be telling them, oh, you're not, you're not going nowhere. They holding on, holding on tight to your person, okay? They holding on tight. But, baby, when that picture surfaced or that something that was said or saw or something, they were shocked, baby. This could be you, Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You shining bright like the damn stars here. This person wanted to see how, yep. This person wanted to see. They turned their back on you. And they wanted to see. I feel like they feel like they can come back. This the connection that they're in, it could be strictly sexual. Or this is like an on again, off again relationship. Like, I don't feel like they're taking this connection that they're in too seriously. This person could be that, uh, your ex, this person could be real handsome or very beautiful, okay? And a lot of people, um, you know, be drooling over them. Four of Swords and the Lovers. I feel like <laughs> I feel like this person. Okay, so four of swords, the love, I'm sorry, the four of swords and the queen of wands and the nine of swords. The person that they dealing with is like, what? They over here stressing out. They over here dealing with disconnection, stressing the hell out. Okay. 
Look at them. Disappointed, jealous, salty. Didn't I tell you? This person that they're dealing with is salty. Okay? They're salty. Salty as hell. Why the lovers here? Because they tried to block they trying to block this person from coming back to you. Okay? Because they feel like, look, you walked away, they left. And I'm I got chose. Pick me, pick me. Chaba. Listen. Y'all keep popping y'all. Keep popping y'all shit on these people. These people are real. They're jealous and they hating. Let's see how your person, um, how they really feel about you. This could be an ex. I feel like it's an ex. That person does have somebody new. We got new love. They got somebody new. But definitely, <laughs> we gotta pay attention to the red flags. Mm. I feel like they wanna heal this connection with you, but they're going about it the wrong way. They're just, well, I'll just get somebody new to keep my mind off of, off of that, my past person. Engagement. They wanna take things to the next level with you. And they're extremely attracted to you. This could be somebody that you have children with or they want to have children with you. But definitely, they know that they did something because we got forgiving and learning here and this could be the one. Like, they know that they did something here. How do they feel about the collective? How does this past person feel about the collective? Codependency. Okay. This person is codependent upon you, but maybe this is something that they have to learn Okay, this is a lesson that they have to learn how to possibly detach from you. Okay? Because there's a lot of deception going on here. They're trying to they're trying to detach from you by bringing in somebody new. This is their way to detach from you. So this person don't even know that they're just a ploy. <laughs> Call me a soulmate. Worth waiting for. Okay, so this connection between you and this person is on hold. While they sitting around, playing around, they they playing. They playing with this person that they with. Okay. Free yourself. Okay, I'm telling you, they're trying to, they are trying to take back control of their life. I feel like this person got some type of obsession with you um, that they're trying to detach from. Okay. Why is pay attention to the red unrequited love? This could be the one. You know, you're separated. And they're trying to put, they're trying to, I'm telling you, this person is doing everything in their power to try to detach themselves from you. Let go of control issues. Yeah, they're trying, I'm telling you, they're trying so hard. <laughs> They are trying so hard to get you off of their mind. Okay? They're trying hard. They're trying to bring in other people to try to get to try to forget about you. I know I messed everything up. We need to let each other go. I'm telling you, like, they they're trying everything that they can. Like I'll just get somebody new. They're trying to replace you. But damn, it's hard. But damn, it's hard. <laughs> what do they want to say to the collective? I wish I could take back my words. Maybe they said something to you that they know they can't come back from. I wish I could share my good news with you. Yeah, they, they feel like they can't even reach out to you. Like, they may be afraid to reach out to you because of something that they said. You and I were too young. So, you could have been dealing with this person for a very long time. Y'all known each other for a long time. It's time for me to heal now. My life is not together as it seems. So, they over there going through it. They don't want you to see what they're going through. Finding out the truth crushed me. Sometimes, I stay awake thinking about you. I wish I had treated you better. And I love you unconditionally. 
This person is looking for you. I look for you everywhere. And they know that they crossed the line with you. And didn't I tell you that they're afraid to contact you? They understand. It's a lesson for them. There's some type of lesson in this situation that they have to learn. Okay? But they can't help it. They're so attracted to you. Okay? They can't help it. They can't even help it. But they trying. They trying to like, oh, they're trying to forget about you. They're trying so hard. But damn, like I said, it ain't that easy. <laughs> It ain't that easy. They trying. They trying to replace you. It ain't easy. Tell me more about this this person. They took a leap of faith. Okay, I feel like they're trying to disconnect. They're disconnecting. Time alone or in nature will help you recharge. They're retreating. Okay. I do feel like they took a leap of faith elsewhere because I feel like they overstepped a boundary with you. They overstepped a boundary with you. Yeah, like I said, obstacles. And I feel like they feel like you're you're reject them. This could be some of y'all could be married to this person, okay? Or you've been together for an extremely long time. But I'm getting strictly sexual. Maybe they had an outside connection. Maybe they were having an affair. Um, and their intuition is telling them that you're going to be unavailable. Like, you're not going to accept accept the fact that they have somebody new. So they had to make a decision. And the decision possibly was to release you. Okay? So they can balance out their energy. And then I feel like they're going to try to come back for a second chance. Once they're more stable... But I'm getting that they're you they could be using this person that they're with, that they're dealing with. Time up oh, I'm sorry, I thought this was time apart. True love. Okay. This person is denying that that they are obsessed with you. They're trying to deny this. This person loves the hell out of you. Okay. Listen, you've learned a spiritual lesson. There's a lesson in this situation. This is a destined partnership that they are trying to put on hold. The timing isn't right, okay? Because they got something else going on. It's not the right time for you and this person to be together, okay? Time alone, there's a retreat. They're retreating. They're disconnecting. Yep, passion. And they're thinking about you sexually as well, too. They're going to try to come back for a second chance, y'all, um, to try to balance things out. They know that you wasn't going to accept something. I feel like they crossed the, they crossed a boundary, and they know they did. They stepped over a boundary. They for sure, for sure did that. And I feel like they're afraid to contact you. They're going to try to let things smooth over. What does this person want to say to my collection? I'm sorry for what I said. <laughs> I told you. They said something. They said something and they, they can't take them words back. So they got to go with the flow now. My head isn't clear enough to make a decision. I'm telling this person not stable. It says, I'm not stable right now. Let me fix this. And they're insecure. But they're going to come in and tell you how they truly feel. Okay? They're going to come in. They're going to come back later and tell you how they feel. I feel like somebody is pushing them. They're listening to other people. I'm sorry for lying to you. This person is really sorry. Like, they're really, like, regretful. But they don't know if you're going to listen to them. They don't know if you're even going to accept all of these apologies. I'm getting like they want to apologize to you. They feel like you're too good for them. And they're undecided. Um, they need time to think this through. And they don't want to be rushed. To make a decision. So that's the message that I have, guys. That was some TT for sure, for sure. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below because that was some tea. All right. 
Um, if you're interested in booking a personal, guys, all that information is in the drop box below. As well, if you would like to donate to this channel, guys, to help this channel grow, the cash shop is going to be in the drop box below. As well, guys, you can check out my website. You can get 20% off today using code SALE20, S-A-L-E, all caps, 20. At the checkout, you get 20% off your entire order, guys. All of that information is in the drop box below. All right? I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao for now.